how to fire your boss, move to paradise, and get paid to help change the world. You're listening to The Victory Podcast with your host, Shane Moran, author of The Victory Book, and one heck of a guy. Here's Shane. Hey, 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 it's a great day. Come on now, shake your money maker. Put your hands together, snap those fingers, wiggle those toes, take a deep breath, do whatever it takes, but make sure that you smile. Come on, give it a try. Just give it a smile there. All right, all right. Welcome to the Victory Podcast, episode number two. And today we're talking money, we're talking gold, and I am honored that you are here And my goal for this episode is to make sure that this becomes an amazing investment of your time. By the end of this episode, if you can say to yourself, now that was a great investment of my time, then my mission is accomplished. And today's podcast is all about money, more specifically, gold. And if you've never owned a piece of gold, if you've never had it in your name, don't panic, don't worry. Most people have never even purchased an ounce or even a gram of gold, but that's about to change, not now, but right now. In the next few episodes, again, my goal is to take you by the hand step by step and delve into a topic that most people feel is kind of complicated. And I want to simplify this in a practical way so that you can become proficient and maybe even become the expert. So the information that I'm going to share with you today is for everyone, regardless of your background or your knowledge or experience. The question is, are you fired up and are you excited about the possibilities of gold? Doesn't that just sound great? Gold. You know, you can say it out loud. One, two, three, gold. So if you're excited about it, then you've come to the right place. So just before we get started into this gold episode, if you've not already listened to episode number one, then make a note and make sure you do so because the Victory Podcast episode, which is number one, uh, is about the Victory Book. And this is the foundation for all episodes that follow. Remember, you need to set too many goals rather than too few because goals are like magnets that will pull you forward into a greater, grander, and more amazing future. I want to encourage you to become a bigger dreamer. Dream bigger. Dream much bigger than you thought was even possible. Okay, normally when I talk about money or more specifically gold, most tune out because they believe that gold is only for the rich, uh, gold is only for the wealthy. And I want to let you know up front, this is not true. This is a big lie. Gold is money and gold is for everyone, whether you are a seasoned investor or whether you've never actually owned even a gram of gold in your name. Today, I'm going to show you how to buy your first gram of gold or your first ounce of silver, if that's what you prefer. And I want you to get started on the road to working and thinking in terms of real money. You know, in 2008, I co-founded a global marketing concept. And at that time, we were going through a global financial crisis very similar to today's economic environment. Do you remember 2008? You know, 2008 actually spawned a new era of distrust, you know, for the world's governing financial institutions. Today, as we move closer to 2022, things have gotten a whole lot worse. Much more debt, much more unstable institutions, and There's more mistrust of the banks. There's more mistrust of financial third-party institutions than ever before. More and more people are looking for answers that make sense. As a means of reducing banking fraud and currency manipulation, cryptocurrencies were born, like Bitcoin, Ethereum, and probably 10,000 more cryptocurrencies. But this solution has created even more new problems on their own. The excessive volatility of these cryptocurrencies that are backed by math and the difficulty in actually using and spending crypto is preventing their mainstream adoption. So who should you trust? I don't know what your answer is to this question. Who should you trust? But I do know my own answer, and it's called Kinesis, the Kinesis Monetary System. You know, in today's episode, 
I'm going to take you on an amazing journey into a new monetary system that everyone is starting to discover. Remember, I'm going to show you how you can even buy your first gram of gold or first ounce of silver in your name and not the name of a third party financial institution like your money is right now. You know, the money you have sitting in the bank, regardless of the amount, is not in your name. More and more people are starting to find out that when things go wrong with a third party financial institution, the actual depositor is the last to get paid. Today, I'm going to be introducing you to the Kinesis Monetary System and not to a bank or a third party institution. Kinesis was founded by ABX, and what ABX stands for is Allocated Bullion Exchange by Mr. Thomas Coughlin. And it's the world's first leading electronic exchange of physical precious metals, gold and silver. And it's a monetary system entrenched and trusted in a global industry. It's now recognized by governments and major institutions around the world. And with knowledge and expertise and experience that has been built over the past decade plus, Kinesis is at the forefront of making history. And they're redefining how physical bullion, which is gold and silver, is traded and how it's used as a functional money and a currency which also pays every customer up to four yields. Yeah, you heard that right. You can now earn a yield on your gold and silver. And this has never, ever been done. And in my opinion, this is genius. That's why I'm fired up. That's why I'm excited about today's topic. Kinesis is the world's first incentivized monetary system based on allocated physical gold and silver. In this first of a kind and unique monetary system, Kinesis has attached a multifaceted yield system that rewards you as a participant in several areas. Whether you hold the gold or silver, convert it or mint it to a digital currency, whether you send it, spend it, or even sell it, you are rewarded. Isn't this amazing? Now, if you're confused right now, don't worry. Okay, we're going to break it down. And I've already mentioned this on previous episodes that I'm going to dedicate multiple episodes to take you by the hand, step by step, just like the victory book, and make sure that you become the expert. But you need to be patient as this has never been done. And I promise it will be worth every single minute that you invest in your learning this new monetary system. All right. So there's no rush. Gold and silver have been around for thousands of years and they're not going anywhere, all right? It's going to continue to be available for thousands of years. So take your time, and unlike traditional math-backed cryptocurrencies, Kinesis coins are backed one-to-one -one with real physical gold or real physical silver. What does this mean? It means that one KAU is one gram of gold, and one KAG represents one ounce of silver. Finally, a digital currency that's backed by real world tier one assets. And the Kinesis gold and silver physical digital currencies convert easily into fiat or paper money with your Kinesis debit card. All right. So you've even got a debit card if you want to spend it, buy a cup of coffee, buy a pair of shoes, or you can even redeem your digital assets for physical gold and physical silver and have it shipped to your door any time you want it. And unlike anywhere else in the world, storage of your gold and silver is always, and I mean always, free. This is very important. If you've already bought gold, if you've already bought silver, and you've had to pay those monthly storage fees, you know exactly how important this is. So here's something else that's very, very important. Everything I'm talking about right now all the gold and all the silver that you start to accumulate is titled to your name and not of a third party bank or financial institution. It doesn't even sit on the Kinesis balance sheet. It's in your name. It's titled to you. Unlike the money that you have right now sitting in the banks or your stocks or your bonds or your ETFs or other financial instruments that are backed by nothing. 
as a precursor to the Kinesis monetary system, a separate digital token was created that you're going to learn about, and it's called the Kinesis Velocity Token, the KVT. KVT holders will get a share of all the transaction fees that are generated by the Kinesis currencies forever. So the more it's used, the greater the rewards to the KVT holders, all right? And again, here's what's important about the KVT, and you're going to learn all about this, is, and it's the best part. There are only 300,000 KVT tokens available ever. Just think about that for a second. There are 25 million millionaires worldwide, 25 million millionaires worldwide, but only 300,000 KVTs. Let that sink in, all right? So when it comes time to the KVTs, you'll be able to acquire KVTs on the exchanges. However, at much higher prices as KVTs each generate ongoing monthly income to its holders. So they'll keep increasing in value every day. They'll keep increasing in value every week, every month, and every year. And with that said, let's begin our money or our goal journey with this short overview and yet another historical day for you and I here. If this is the first time you've ever heard about this revolutionary monetary system, Kinesis is the future of money. And it's worth the time that you invest to learn all you can, step by step. The journey that you're about to take will help in this effort, all right? And with that, welcome to gold. Enjoy. Gold is the language of the world. As a matter of fact, you can go to any area of the world and just say the word gold and people are going to know what you're talking about. Gold is also the money of the world. Once again, you can go to any area of the world and show them a piece of gold, and they're gonna know exactly that it's valuable. Whether you're struggling financially right now, having a hard time paying your bills, or whether you're a millionaire, a multimillionaire, or whether you're somewhere in between, the information that will be shared with you over the next few minutes will not only have a positive impact on you personally, it will have a positive impact on anyone you know who holds, sends, or spends money. My name is Shane Moran, and in 2008, I co-founded a global marketing concept that generated $1 billion in sales within a five-year period and impacted more than 2.2 million families in 55 countries around the world. Back in 2008, I've always had a dream and a vision to be able to pay suppliers and distributors, affiliates or workers or employees with physical gold or physical silver. Of course, back in 2008, that wasn't possible, but it is now. I have a very important question to ask. And if you have a pen and a piece of paper, you might want to write this down. Because what I'm about to teach you is worth remembering. Have you heard of Gresham's Law? Most people I've asked have never heard of Gresham's Law, and the very few that have heard of it can't explain it. So let me ask you a few questions, and hopefully you'll have an experience of what Gresham's Law is so that you can experience it in everyday life. Imagine. Let's imagine you walk into the market to buy some food, and in your cart you gather exactly $100 worth of items. You get to the cashier, and in one hand, you have a $100 bill. And in the other hand, imagine you're holding a piece of gold that's worth exactly $100. If the cashier told you that they'd accept either, which would you give to pay for your food? I've asked people from all over the world why they would give the paper $100 bill rather than the gold. And their answer is basically the same. They want to hold the gold because they feel it's more valuable. And this is Gresham's Law. Gresham's Law says that the bad money always drive out the good money. In other words, people will always choose to spend the bad money and hold on to the good money. In this case, we're talking about gold. Why is Gresham's Law so important to understand? Because for the first time in history, the CEO of ABX, Mr. Thomas Coughlin, and Kinesis Money have figured out a way to reverse Gresham's Law, and this is genius. Introducing the Kinesis Monetary System. This is historic and an opportunity for you and anyone you know to profit 
every time you or they hold, send, or even spend money. So let's get started. Here are the four ways to earn with the Kinesis Monetary System. Hold. The first way to earn with the Kinesis Monetary System is by holding physical gold or physical silver. The fact is that very, very few people around the world have even purchased one ounce of gold or one ounce of silver. With the Kinesis Monetary System, it's important to remember we are talking about physical gold and physical silver and never about certificates, never about paper, or never about digits. It's physical gold and physical silver. That belongs to you. You own it. It's in your name or even in your company's name. The three main challenges with holding gold or silver are the following. Number one, there is no yield attached to gold or silver in a physical format. There are monthly storage fees. And finally, number three, it's hard to spend a piece of gold. It's hard to spend a piece of silver. With the Kinesis Monetary System, everything changes. Number one, there is a yield every single month just from holding physical gold or physical silver. The second is monthly storage fees. There are no monthly storage fees ever. And now, thanks to the Kinesis Monetary System, they have found a way so that you can actually use it to purchase food or a cup of coffee or even withdraw money from your local ATM machine. Are you starting to see an opportunity here? Actually, the way Kinesis allows people like you and I to spend gold and silver on everyday items the fact that they never charge storage fees and the fact that they're taking a non-yielding producing asset and turning it into a yield producing asset is historical. The second way you can choose to earn with Kinesis is by minting gold and or silver into digital coins called KAU for gold and KAG for silver. Minting is the process of taking physical gold and or silver and converting it into a digital form. In digitalizing your physical bullion, you are effectively giving birth to a gold-based currency that is attached to the physical bullion that sits in the Kinesis vaults. We call these currencies KAU for gold and KAG for silver. One KAU represents one gram of gold. The Minter's Yield has been created to reward people for their everyday spending as once you create the Kinesis coin, it is available to spend. You would create this new currency and because it's on the blockchain, KAU and or the KAG forever remembers who gave birth to the coin and an additional yield is paid to the Minter forever. Yes, that's right, forever, month after month after month after month and so on. Once again, this is historical and has never been done. Are you starting to see the possibilities for yourself here? The third way to earn with Kinesis is with the KVT. The KVT is the Kinesis Velocity Token. And this is what is used to fund and to support this historical global monetary system. There's only 300,000 available, and when they're gone, they're gone. Now the interesting thing about the KVT is when you own one or more KVTs, you now share a yield in the entire monetary system based on the transaction fees that occur worldwide. Month after month after month after month, as long as you hold your KVT. And the fourth way to earn with Kinesis is with the referral yield. Let me ask you a question. Seriously, who do you know who holds sends or spends money at least occasionally and if you're like me your answer is everybody there are billions of people on the planet and many of them have bank accounts but also many of them don't have access or even qualify to open a bank account for example in indonesia alone there are 260 million residents who do not even have a bank account so when you refer someone to open their own free kinesis account you receive a referral yield based on the transaction fees that are generated by that wallet month after month after month after month and it's paid in gold or silver. At this point, you're probably asking yourself, where is the money coming from to allow Kinesis 
to pay out yields, not only to the holders, but to the minters, to the KVT holders, and also the refers. As you know, there are trillions of dollars globally that are being transacted every day. And I've seen fees from 2% as high as 20% just to transact. With the Kinesis Monetary System, the transaction fee is 0.45%. That's right, less than half of a percent, no matter what the amount is, whether it's a dollar or $10 million. Imagine the global transaction fees, fees happening in Korea and Japan and Thailand or Canada, United States, UK, Europe, Latin America. Are you starting to get excited here? That's where the money comes from. So now that you know where the yields are coming from, let's review. The holders receive 15% on that yield. The minters, 5%. The KVT holders, a whopping 20%. And finally, on your referrals, you receive a 7.5% of the transactions that occur within that wallet. Back to the market in Gresham's Law. Knowing what you now know about the Kinesis Monetary System, and when given the opportunity to spend your money, which would you choose? The $100 bill or Kinesis? <laughs> ask one question and that question is this whether your money is in the bank account or in the forex or in stocks or in bonds or in cryptocurrencies bitcoin the question is this have they defeated or reversed gresham's law if not welcome to kinesis to get started sign up below And there you have it, your introduction to gold and the Kinesis Monetary System. So to register, just visit isavegold.com. That's isavegold.com. But if you'd like more information, you want to learn more, you can visit shanemoran.com and look for the money link at shanemoran.com. Now, just imagine as more and more people around the world discover the genius of the Kinesis monetary system, and they get rewarded for holding, sending, spending, and even minting gold, minting silver into a digitalized currency. On the next episode of the Victory Podcast, that's episode number three, we'll continue with our money and gold topic once again and take you step by step, and I'm talking step by baby step, to answer questions like, what is money? What is digital gold? What is a KAU and a KAG? We'll talk about the Kinesis debit card. What is the Kinesis exchange and how does that work? What is a yield? What is a minter's yield? What is a holder's yield? What is a referrer yield and how does that work? What is the depositor's yield? What is the KVT and more about the KVT yield and so much more. Are you beginning to dream bigger? Are you beginning to dream even much bigger? If you have begun this process using your victory book, notice how you feel and be sure to stick with the formula until you absolutely master it. Has this episode been a great investment of your time? I certainly hope so. And if it has, Please share this episode with the one person that comes to mind and get yourself a workout partner, you know, so that you can share ideas and you can share potential strategies together or better yet, create your own mastermind team of like-minded people and begin your journey of moving in a similar direction together. That's all I have for you today. And I'll see you next time on the Victory Podcast. Now make this your best day ever. Bye for now. Thanks for listening to the Victory Podcast with Shane Morand. Be sure to subscribe now to be notified about new episodes in real time. If you haven't yet downloaded your free Victory audiobook, visit victorybook.com.